Fix the installation failed in the first underscore boot phase while installing Windows 10. Case study 1, error code 0xc1900101, 0x30018, the installation failed in the first underscore boot phase with an error during sysprep operation. Solution 1, step 1, reset Windows update components. For newbies, try the following bat file at https colon slash slash goo.gl slash rbabfk. For experienced users, try the below guide at https colon slash slash goo.gl slash zxkxvs. Instead, Step 2, if the error persists, examine if you have a third-party antivirus program enabled during Windows 10 installation. We kindly recommend temporarily disabling any third-party antivirus software you have before attempting the update. Note, if you have to temporarily disable it to install Windows 10 and slash or other software, you should re-enable it as soon as you're done. If you're connected to the internet or a network while your antivirus software is disabled, your computer is vulnerable to attacks. Step 3, check if your computer supports UEFI. If so, please follow the steps below to access the UEFI settings, click Start. Type settings and press enter. Click update and security. Click recovery. Under advanced startup, click restart now. After your computer restarts, click troubleshoot. Click advanced options. Click UEFI firmware settings. Click the restart button. Once your computer restarts, you should be taken to the UEFI settings, which varies for each manufacturer. Find the boot settings and turn off fast boot, aka, startup, if it's on. Restart your computer and see if you're able to install Windows 10 creators update after that. Step 4. Try installing Windows 10 Creators Update from the clean boot mode. Solution 2, Step 1. Check the following list at https colon slash slash goo.gl slash fng8dp. To determine if your computer is fully compatible with the Windows 10 Creators Update or Anniversary Update or not. Step 2, review 12 things you should do before installing Windows 10 Creators Update, version 1703, at https colon slash slash goo.gl slash mckufr. Also review the below troubleshooting posts, 10 tips before installing the latest Windows 10 at https colon slash slash goo.gl slash h9 or j8. And 10 things to do if Windows 10 setup fails at https colon slash slash goo.gl slash hghmicg. Tip, if you see a failure message C1900101x300xx, it means Windows 10 installation failed during this phase. The most common failure is x30018, which generally means a driver crashed when Windows 10 setup program loaded it for the first time. Any driver could cause the failure, but it may not crash 100% of the time. If you try again, it may just work. Step 3, run the following command rundle32.exe. Clean.dll rundle underscore clean. Slash driver slash max clean as the admin user. Tip, to do that, press Windows key and X. Solution 3, download Windows 10 ISO file at https colon slash slash goo.gl slash srqjc. To install Windows 10 directly. Solution 4, run the above mentioned command rundle32.exe. Clean.dll rundle underscore clean. Slash driver slash max clean as the admin user. Tip, disconnect your computer from the internet during setup, if you are connected by LAN. Ethernet slash local area connection, or Wi-Fi, disable both and run the setup file again. Additionally, 1. Disable, preferably uninstall, your antivirus utility using the recommended uninstall tool pro in this video guide. 2. Disable general USB devices, example, smart card reader. 3. Do a clean boot and try again. 4. If you are updating through Windows Update, when the download reaches 100% disconnect from the Internet LAN, Ethernet, or Wi-Fi and proceed with the installation. 5. If you are connected to a domain, switch to a local account. 6. If you have any external devices attached to your machine, disconnect them, example, USB keys, external hard disk, printers, non-essential devices. Other info, may work for Dell computer users, you need to aware of, 1. Dell is not fully testing or developing Windows 10 drivers for their PCs. If you choose to upgrade, some features, applications, and connected devices may not work as expected. 
See official source at https colon slash slash gl slash cft6cr. 2. For optimum performance you need 56 GB free disk space, Vabroom, on C partition, drive, and 38 GB to be able to defragment. 3. Before you run disk cleanup, you must close down all running programs. Right click the start icon, select command prompt, admin, and click OK. Type clean br and press the enter key. Click the OK to the default C partition. Scroll through the list and check the box before previous Windows installation, S, and the boxes before any other files you wish to delete. Click OK. 4. Check if the NetTCP port sharing service has started and that the startup type is automatic. 5. For power users, you may run specky at https colon slash slash goo.gl slash cjr607 to obtain the report at a time when the system is under pressure and temperatures may be higher than normal and download and run driver view at https colon slash slash goo.gl slash h8kj up and dig around the report it produces later. 6. To prevent a driver update, you check the below article at https colon slash slash goo.gl slash hcztrv. Case study 2, 0xc1900101 0x30017. The installation failed in the first underscore boot phase with an error during boot operation. Solution 1, Step 1, Manually disconnect to your computer except mouse and keyboard. Step 2, Check it. Or using any third-party antivirus software. If so, you temporarily disable it. Note. Any data files that are infected may only be cleaned by deleting the file entirely, which means there is a potential for data loss. Disclaimer, if you have to temporarily disable it to install Windows 10 and slash or other software, you should re-enable it as soon as you're done. If you're connected to the internet or a network while your antivirus software is disabled, your computer is vulnerable to attacks. Step 3, place your computer in the clean boot. Note, after you have finished clean boot, boot your system to normal startup. Step 4, Try upgrading your system to the latest Windows 10 using Windows 10 ISO at https colon slash slash goo.gl slash srqjc. Other voices, 1. Turn the internet off after Windows 10 setup program has downloaded all required data and before it starts the upgrade. 2. Try installing with Windows Update and disconnect your internet connection. 3. Perform a clean. Install using an original Windows 10 ISO file. 4. Disable or set the page file as recommended for your SSDs, if you're using, just before doing the upgrade, 4.1. Uncheck the box right before automatically manage paging file size for all drives option. 4.2 Select drive C, or the drive where Windows 10 is installed. 4.3 Select custom size by ticking its radio button, and change the initial size, MB, and maximum size, MB, to the recommended value that you will find just below the total paging file size for all drivers section. Solution 2, Download Windows
10 ISO file and perform upgrade installation using the ISO. Option 1. Download Windows 10 ISO file using the media creation tool at https colon slash slash goo.gl slash atlu16. Tip, in the media creation tool, choose the second option to create an installation media and choose the ISO option. Once you have the ISO file, open it from within your previous operating system and click on the setup.exe file to begin the upgrade. Make sure that you don't boot from the installation media and perform a clean install. Option 2. Directly download Windows 10 ISO file at https colon slash slash goo.gl slash srqjc. Case study 3, 0xc1900101, 0x3000d. The installation failed in the first underscore boot phase with an error during migrate underscore data operation. Solution, check if your device is fully compatible with Windows 10. See details at https colon slash slash goo.gl slash ybix70. Other voice, try using media creation tool to download an ISO and then using that ISO to make a bootable USB drive. Case study 4, 0xc1900101, 03008. The installation failed in the first underscore boot phase with an error during CISREP operation. Try a clean install from the Windows 10 ISO.